Hey everybody, I'm back at Disneyland. Uh, started at California Adventure this time this morning. And I'm trying to do a lot of stuff I haven't done at the parks on this visit. But to uh, start out, Soren's only 10 minutes. So, I gotta do that. Alrighty, just got off finish riding Soren. Anybody who knows me knows that's kind of a must for me. Um, similar to when Planes came out, they did something with the Planes Fire and Rescue where they added the animation into the opening queue. Um, and when you come, you'll kind of notice some merchandise and other things for the Planes Fire and Rescue. And uh, they added it to the little sign up here again, as you can see. So, they find ways to incorporate the Planes movie for sure. But off to uh, something else. Oh yeah, um, I'm wearing some of my Keith Lapinick buttons again. I got the pretty cool and the unbirthday, so we'll see what happens with those today. And uh, see you later. I totally almost forgot. My favorite princess's ride is back open now. It was closed last time I was here. It's a ride on Ariel. <laughs> Yep, just got off aerial. Uh, I missed that ride, it was really good. Basically they they added some more fish to it, so it kind of fills it in a little bit more, and it costs a couple extra animatronics. And then they kind of refurbished the aerial dancing in the under the sea segment, so she's looking pretty good. See ya. Okay, so I'm back at the pier. Just waiting for the uh, instant concert with water deal to start. Um, so I went to the Monkey Vision 3D. Uh, if anyone follows me on Instagram or Twitter, you'll know that that's kind of quietly becoming one of my favorite attractions. I don't know, it just seems like it's very underrated, so you should definitely check it out if you haven't done it yet. It's a fun little like 15, 20 minute deal inside a theater and it's nice and cool and it's pretty funny, so I'd recommend it. Um, then I, uh, did a little meet and greet with Minnie Mouse. I decided to splurge on one of the autograph books because all these years I've never done that and I figured it'd be kind of fun. So Minnie got to be my first autograph. That's pretty cool. Uh, and we'll see how many I can get in the time that I'm here. But uh, yeah, that's it for now. Mickey Magical Map Show. Uh, I originally was just going to come to Disneyland side just to get a corn dog and then go back to catch Aladdin, but it was going to be too late for that, so I wanted to catch the show again anyway, and then I'll head back over and catch the Aladdin show, and hopefully jump back over so I can see the Frozen Free Parade deal. So, but I'm going to warn out. It's it's hot and humid today, so. It's a little Florida-esque. You are but an apprentice, Mickey. Someday, when you learn the secret of the map, then you may join the others. Oh, gosh.
night, so just finished meeting the princesses at the Royal Hall. Uh, I happened to walk by and it was only a 10 minute wait, so can't really pass that up. And this was Ariel and Cinderella, yet again. Uh, but I got Snow White this time, so I hadn't seen her before. Um, no videos of them this time. There's, um, even though it's like I got there when it was 10 minutes and it started to really pack up, so I wanted to kind of get through the line. So I did get to have some conversations, so I wish I could have videoed, but didn't this time. But I did get their autographs. So I even got Ariel's autograph, and she made hers all extra special because I told her she was my favorite. So, like always, Ariel digs me. What can I say? Uh, just missed seeing the Tangled show. I didn't quite make it in time for that. Um, but speaking of Tangled and Rapunzel, I wanted to give a shout out to a friend of mine from social media, YouTube and Twitter and Instagram, um, at Little Liz, and I'll put the tag down below. Um, there was a chance she might have been able to get out here to California in time to hang out here, but it didn't quite work out that way, but I told her I'd give her a shout out on my video. Um, and I'm doing it in reference to Tangled and Rapunzel, because they were just in the theater right there and all that stuff. So, Liz, wish you were here, but hey, what can you do? So, see ya. Alright, so just got off the racers, I had a fast pass for that. And before that I saw the Aladdin show finally, so that was really good. I'd seen clips of it on YouTube, but never seen it in person, so... I definitely recommend seeing it. Uh, it could have used a little bit more air conditioning in the theater because it's so stinking hot today. So like for the first 20 minutes I was sweating bullets, but it was a good show. Uh, the singing is really good and the acting is really well done. So go see it. Okay, so it's been a little while since I filmed. As you can see, it's nighttime out. Um, I've just been doing a few things. Uh, I'm trying to remember here. I did the Beauty and the Beast show at uh, Fantasy Fair for the first time. That was pretty cool. Um, I had seen little bits and pieces of it before, but never actually sat down and watched it. So I like that. Uh, so other than that, I did a couple of rides, Pirates and Haunted Mansion. Um, and on that note, I wanted to send another shout out to another social media friend of mine. Um, Seth Larson. Uh, if you're on Instagram, you probably recognize him as Seth Camden. Um, but cool guy who lives out here in California. Really uh, spectacular artist. Uh, does a lot of really great Disney uh, artwork. Um, wouldn't surprise me in the least if you ended up seeing his stuff in one of the Disney galleries years down the road because he's that good. Um, but he and I were going to see about potentially meeting up while I was out here, but schedules changed and he's not going to be out here as soon as I am, obviously. So, um, he and I have had a string of bad luck. The last time we were here, we were actually both at the park at the same time and still missed each other. So, one of these days it'll work out, but really cool guy um, with, all I can say, a lot of great artwork. So, I'll post links to all of his stuff down below also. So, Almost the end of the night for me, so I'll check back in before I go. Bye. Okay, uh, in my car, obviously, so that's it for tonight. Uh, I think I'm gonna be coming back for another day, I'm pretty sure. Um, so this shouldn't be a full goodbye. If for whatever reason I don't, then hope you enjoyed the video and like, subscribe, whatever floats your boat. Um, but if not, then See you in a second. Bye. Hey, what's up, everybody? So I'm back for another day. Um, so far, just ridden uh, Indiana Jones. I was originally planning to do the Elsa and Anna meetup this morning, and I got here right at park opening at eight o'clock, and no joke, at eight o two when I got to the queue line for the meetup with Anna and Elsa. It was already a two hour wait. We're talking two or three minutes after park opening. Because that's how many people rush over to do that right now. So it's, that's just insane. So hopefully someday that will be not quite as ridiculous. But to have it that long after within five minutes of the park opening. Ugh. Anyway, see ya.
here to see another show in a magical map again today. Um, yeah, I know I saw it yesterday, but I'm really starting to really enjoy this show, so I definitely recommend it. Um, otherwise, earlier I also went and saw went to the Fantasy Fair area and saw the Tangled show. So I think now I've seen every stage show here finally, so I really enjoyed that one. And then I went and saw the princesses again because it was a short wait. I saw the same Ariel as I saw yesterday, and she remembered me. And boy, I really wish I would have gotten this one on video because we had a really fun, long conversation. Um, we talked about how uh, hot it was. There you go. Um, it is really hot though, again today. But so I'm gonna enjoy the show of Magical Map and then see where I go from there. See ya. And are you, you have an unbirthday? Yes, it is my unbirthday today. Well, happy unbirthday! Thank you very much. And what are you doing for your unbirthday other than being at Disneyland? That's pretty are much you it. Have some cake? Uh, I'll try. I love cake, especially on my unbirthday, which is yeah. so great. But well, I'm glad I got to meet you. You're the one of the princesses I never seem to be able to find when I'm here. So. Oh, really? Yeah. I like to play hide and go seek with Raja a lot. Oh, do you? Yes. <laughs> but I actually, I have a friend who comes where, from Arizona, where I'm from, okay. who couldn't make it here, but she, you're her favorite princess. Mm -hmm. I was wondering if you might be able to tell her hello. Sure. What's your name? Kayla. Okay. And you can just tell her. Right? Oh, it's yeah. whenever. Yep. Hello, Kayla. I heard you're over in Arizona. I would like for you to come visit me soon. Maybe you can take a ride on the magic carpet. Bye-bye. Beautiful. Thank you so much. Hello there. Hi there. Please give me the eyes. We've seen, we've seen each other before. We've seen each other. We have. Oh, I'll write, I'll get in this a second. I'm actually, I'm very excited to meet the two of you. Because we have the same pen. I actually, I wore this hoping that I would meet Glenn Ryder. The coolest really? guy he knows. Wait, wait. Sorry, he's got really excited. <laughs> I got now, I gotta, I, 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 I gotta admit though, I am a little more excited to meet Rapunzel than... Oh, but, I don't, I don't fall to it all, so. Yeah. Thank you. So, you know, and I watched, I watched your show earlier. You did you very did. well. I love the show. Do you have a favorite part? Uh, probably the part where Take you bring me. him back to life because oh. we can't have a world without Flynn Ryder. Oh man, you are you are something else. I gotta tell so. you. We have another, we have, if you want to get back in line, then come through again. <laughs> it's fine with me. We can open and back open for you. Okay. I'll think about that. So. Alrighty, that's gonna do it for me for this trip now. Uh, probably could have stayed longer today, but this heat and humidity is just killing me. I don't know how you people in Florida do it all the time. Uh, so I didn't quite do a whole lot of the rides and stuff that I haven't done before, but I did meet some people that I haven't met before, like uh, Jasmine and then uh, Rapunzel and Flynn from Tangled, so that was pretty nice. Uh, overall, it's a good trip. Um, it just would have been better if I didn't sweat bullets <laughs> the last couple of days, but hey, I mean, you're Disneyland, who cares, so um, hope you all enjoy the video, like, subscribe, share the link, whatever you want to do, and uh, as I mentioned before, I'll put the links down to my shout out social media folks so you can visit their stuff and like and subscribe to them, so, uh, yep, that'll be it, and until next time.